right. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. I'm <laughs> just checking the power of the stream right now and making sure everything is okay. Of course, the it's always going to be in yellow as we get into it. But we have that podcast and we are live in full effect. So, hey. <laughs> you already know, special guest is Mr. Different. I tried to get MG the Future in here. I tried to get a craftsman up in here. And just because uh, they had a pretty lit show today. It was crazy. And, you know, Hell I was yeah. trying to get everybody uh, situated in this. So we are live. Let's go ahead and tweet that out. So if you can tweet it out, because it will really help the show and, you know, share the YouTube video. Hit that share button, Facebook all that good stuff, whatever will help. I, you know, I will, it will be greatly appreciated by the squad over here. And yeah, it, it's going to be an interesting show. I mean, <laughs> uh, just looking at the topics here. First topic is Curtis King leaving YouTube, but then we're going to talk about image line flex and flexing for social media. And, <laughs> mm. <laughs> and then of course we have the patented Q and a with the chat asks us questions and then we'll answer it. So, yeah, it's going to be a pretty good show here. As you can see, I got a new microphone. <laughs> the <Woo>. Aston Origin. <laughs> hey, we talked talk yeah. about that one. They talked about last week and look at it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. I, I, I saw, when I saw the few videos, especially the acoustic guitar videos, and then uh, a lot of the electric guitar videos, the Boss Katana video uh, for the guitar amp, I was like, man, it, this something about this microphone i really like i really like his dynamics like looking straight like at the camera it sounds good and you know it's and it has a small form factor too but you know we, we ain't here to really talk about that we're here to talk about the stuff here but uh exactly. Shooting this, I, talk that shit let's get it yeah so uh, <laughs> i really i, I should have reached out to curtis king I'm, we're gonna have curtis king on this on the show one day i mean you know he's a really good guy and all that but before we do let me go ahead and share this up with everybody please share it you know uh, let everybody know that we are going live and i'm gonna hit everybody with the intro uh in a second here as i hit everybody on facebook up uh we green we are good to go and you already know trap tendo let's go intro bars <laughs> Right, we are live and we are in full effect. We got a lot of stuff to talk about today. The theme is flexing. We're, we're talking about a whole bunch of flexing stuff. Um, again, uh, shout out to MG The Future and uh, Craftsman over there for their podcast. They kept it very spicy today. It was the first time mm -hmm. I tuned in from the beginning to end. Yep. And it was, it, was, it was good. It was a good one. I it, was, it. it was a really good one. Uh, I, I was always I always catch theirs and then I have to get going. I'm like, oh, it's not. I get ready for Av, me and Av stream, but yeah, I try to yeah. get as much as I can. And they, they just I always go back and watch it. But yeah, their, their streams are really good. Yeah. So yeah, Happy Easter, everybody. By the way, I almost forgot that it is oh, yeah, Easter man. Sunday. You know, at these holidays when you get older, it's just like uh, it's like hey, it's just a holiday. I ain't, I ain't doing that. <laughs> right. So you know we. <laughs> We're we're just like kind of just tuning in here. Let me go adjust this shit over here. Get it right. Get it right over yeah, there. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> you know, I always put them over my hoodie and stuff because my ears have a tendency to hurt after a while. So you know, right? Really, I, mean, I don't have no problem with the, my DTs. I mean, I, I like it. my 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 um Sennheisers though. I, mean, I, I gotta take them off every so often. Oh yeah, yeah. Them shit squeeze your head, man. God Boy. dang, they squeeze your head. But yeah, shout out to the chat here. I see Phil Ramsey has pulled up, and I see Busy Boy, Big Bro, up in here. Everybody gets a echo shout out. Shout out. DJ shout Georgie Porgy, Jr. Young was good. <laughs> Artist travel, Artist travel, music travels. Travel. What's going on? All right, so uh, yeah, man, first... give me a give me a fix pedal now. <laughs> a fix up here. <laughs> well, you know that's the that's the Soundcraft signature tin. So you know, hey, I was looking at getting one. Yeah. Talk about that next week. Yeah, I, so, I get one. 
Yeah, so uh, for those that are new to the podcast that just happen to be tuning in on Sunday here, uh, the special guest is Mr. Different. I have the link in the description box. I think you should subscribe to him. I think he does some really good stuff. This is how his channel looks like. And this is why. Oh, my bad. (laughs) You good? good, good. My bad. I said appreciate it. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. So, you know, he, he's dropped some pretty good videos. Uh, the How to Make a Struggle Trap Beat. <laughs> hey, hey, I, I, got, I, got, I got the low file coming out tomorrow. Got, Yo. I, I just shot it. Got the low file coming out tomorrow. Y'all better be ready for it. Subscribe. <laughs> Get that bail. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> I, I just, I don't know, man. <laughs> I just think those are really clever. And obviously, people are digging it. And I really like that. Um, I appreciate it. So, you know, uh, as far as, like, the poll last week or whatnot, and what we at, five minutes and 36 seconds? Yeah, so as far as the poll last week, it was this right here. Which uh, music equipment store do you prefer and why? I had Guitar Center, which uh, leads at 59%, so I'm not really surprised there. Sam Ash at 7%. Holy shucks. And, yeah, people talking about Guitar Center is in trouble. Boy, I mean, holy crap here. And... Other thirty four percent. So you know you got your mix of sound. Uh, not was it sounds dot com, and what's the other one? Uh, damn, the one you were talking about, the one you you shop at overseas, the European one, right? Oh, oh yeah. Well, Juno Records uh, that that's still an exclusive to me. You know, some people are in there. Shout out to uh, <laughs> Rizzo, right? oh, okay, gotcha. <laughs> Yeah. Well, yeah, that's all. I'm in the sound. Sweetwater, 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 of course. Sweet water. My guy over at Sweetwater. Hopefully, get some new stuff. Yeah, so we we got some pretty special stuff there. So, uh, yeah, you know, we read the comments last time. It was over 327 votes. So, uh, for those who don't know, you can vote over here. I didn't. I didn't set up a poll. Um, damn. This week, uh, just really, I don't know. Maybe this week. How about I just set it up right now? Okay. <laughs> uh, should. Curtis King, this is gonna be so tacky when they uh listen to this on Spotify. He's typing, that's not professional. He should be prepared. Yes, I I, I totally agree. This this the Trap Tendo podcast. I don't if y'all know how it worked by now, y'all don't know how it worked. <laughs> I I'll say the poll will be this. Uh, uh should Curtis King come back? Uh I put come by to YouTube back oh there we go so everybody get to see the visual there they get the <laughs> clown <laughs> and i love it when people clown and i'm gonna put yes or no we're just gonna be straightforward and you know and i, I guess i put why because you know I, I like to hear from the community here and we'll we'll get into the the country uh old town <laughs> old oh, town man. road after creek <laughs> Well, hey, hey, though, hey, though, man, I'm waiting for it. I told you, man, you need them country vocals, man, hit me up, man, I got it. I've been practicing, I've been practicing my, my country vocals. Uh, Steve Cruz, uh, Cruz, the Cruz, oh my God, that's so tacky. Uh, what about uh, J&R Music World? Well, we don't have that already. I, I think that's more of a West Coast thing, I believe. Uh, Full Compass, I've heard of him, of course, Music Friends, <laughs> Street Water. Music Friends, yeah. <laughs> Street water. <laughs> Street water. <laughs> there you go. Well, that's, Yo. that's when you pay the, when you pay the crackhead with five dollars to go into the store and rob it for you. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, <laughs> I like it. Mr. Different is piped up on this Easter Sunday. Hey, Let's good, go. Man. Let's go. Beautiful day. Sun is shining. Everybody's doing good. It's another beautiful day. Come on. Let's get it. I'm ready for it. Let's get to this podcast. I'm, I'm lit. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, like, I'm for real. I'm for real uh, surprised at all the stuff that just happened this week. Like, it's just been so freaking much shit. But... Oh, man. That freaking topic we talked about the other day. We had to, that was like, oh yeah, yeah. That, that, that was definitely Curtis King. That was definitely uh, inspired by Curtis King. Like, and, and unlike unlike the FL Studio one, I, I kind of feel him on this one. Uh, but what you was talking about, what you was talking about, had me kind of rolling though, for real. That's, 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 that's for next for next week. That's for next week. That's right. gonna be exclusive next week. <laughs> so heading over here to to Twitter and and uh, follow him on Twitter. By the way, uh, Curtis King. That is. And, you know, he's very checked out. Uh, so, you know, he he's le- legit. Uh, he has hus- husband, father, Arthur, music producer, YouTube production credits, Kendrick Lamar, Absol, Little Skies, and E-40. 
40 and MERS. Now I knew him from MERS. Like that's what I, that's what I knew him from. And I think he recently put that on there because, uh, people were, um, when he in initially announced that he was leaving YouTube, like some, some people was like, man, wh what did you do? What, like, what have you done? I'm like, why do producers always got to, uh, prove themselves worthy of the good knowledge that they're giving that nobody else will give you? Like, exactly. Like, I mean, you don't have to show your credits not at all time. I mean, shoot, the fact is the man makes multiple videos a week, giving out great information and knowledge. And then, you know, people want to, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, come on, I need to chill. With this yeah. Shit. Good quality videos at that. Like you, you can't deny the fact that he actually spends that actual time uh, with the community to, give out that useful information like he he doesn't have to do that he doesn't like for real like like let 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 that be known like he doesn't have to uh sit here and uh go back and forth with people over some of the the most benign bullshit mm -hmm. like like the most benign bullshit about some credits like think about your average music producer that does have credits and how much they have done for the community in general like they probably haven't done shit but flex their watches, chains, we, 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 car. We know, we know one half. <coughs> oh um, shit! Oh, um, man, it's like we we know we know song. Oh, uh, uh, <laughs> fuck <laughs> that bitch ass dude. But yeah, man, it's it's, 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 it's cr exactly man. Like it, it's crazy though. Like they look at like shit. You got like you have to. I don't know. Well, I'm gonna try to say. I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna say. I'm over here studying like a motherfucker I'm because it works. Exactly. It's just like. It doesn't matter how, like how many credits you got, whatever. The fact is, if you're giving good knowledge and constantly giving it, people should be appreciative because there's so many people, like I said, who don't do that at all and won't do that because they're afraid, you know, people are gonna either steal from them, right. rehash it, repackage it, whatever. It's like, bro, like, no, nah, I don't know, don't get, don't do that, man, like that shit. Like, you got multiple videos of him giving out gems that you know the like the smart ones would pick up on and be like, damn, that's. That's legit. The smart ones little, have, and, and they yeah. put that shit on their YouTube channel and not get yeah. this motherfucker no credit. Like, dog, yeah. like, that's yeah. the problem. I, I, I say, just, if you're if you going to do that, just give credit with credit due. Like, for real. Like, and people don't do that, but it's, it's what it is, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, I mean, the whole basis of it, you know, he's leaving YouTube. Yeah, made the announcement video, mm -hmm. and, you know, it, it, it hit like wildfire. Um, shout out to him. He, he let me do a testimony and whatnot. And I had to give him his props and I'm glad he actually uh, reached out to me uh, to do so. And, you know, he he's starting his own thing. Here we go. We got I'm leaving YouTube, the video, whatnot. I guess I'll uh, click in on it. It's a real short video. Uncensored and unfiltered content for me. Also, you're going to finally get some in-depth FL Studio tutorials beyond the stuff that I teach within my course. And speaking of my courses, you actually get access in this membership area to all my courses presently and in the future, as long as you stay a member. In addition to that, this platform is going to put you also in a private Discord community that is going to get you answers to your music producer and your rapper questions. You'll have an opportunity to promote your music, get critiques on your beats by me and other people within the community. So that means no more worrying about content id we can do whatever we want because i'm uploading videos directly to my platform and now like i think people all right so so the main thing i think people are kind of work uh they feel like oh well he's just using that as a muse of him doing the uh the, he said this uh well i'm not even gonna read that comment yet mm -hmm. <laughs> just read, read the chat though so the thing is this right here and it is it's weird because you can't sell out if you're selling yourself anyways. And also it's up to the community to support and sell in, you know what I'm saying? Exactly. And that is so rare. And I hate to say it in, you know, it was kind of apparent in, in certain cases with comments and I, I don't care. I'll jump into the fire. Uh, it's, it's always like that for the black community. Like it's really hard for people to uh, sell it into another uh, black entrepreneur enthusiasts and you know some people don't want to uh tackle that com that conversation but it, it it is and also another reason why and this is just underlined this is something that we me and him talked about like off off the record and i know i do apologize for him for that but there's been people that has been that that's been quite advocate of attacking him about some of the mere stupidest shit like uh uh, people from other music producer communities that obviously don't give a damn about their community, but you know, you know, they, they are quick to take his topics 
and either spin it around, uh, make fun of him. Of course, I was uh, uh, felt pale victim to that, even though I wasn't like, man, fuck Curtis King. Yeah. I was just yeah. like, like this nigga got caught up by FL, made a video about it. It, it, <laughs> like, it, it more like bringing awareness you know to it, just being having fun with it. It wasn't like, you know, we're stealing it, trying to, you know, profit off of it. It's just like, we're just doing it for the fun of it. Like, there's people who actually steal from people and try to profit off of it, which is like, damn, come on. Like, shit. Yeah, and, and it's definitely, and some people actually get it. Like, it's it's business. Like, at the end of the day, like, when you're on YouTube, you really don't make like there's people that make money on YouTube. Like, I, of course, I'm at a point now uh, we're, we're at a point now that where we make some money from YouTube. Yeah, uh, I mean, yeah, I mean, it's not like my thing is like, especially if like, if, you, if, you're, if your whole thing is just making money off of YouTube, it's going to be really hard unless you're doing like just absolutely stupid shit to clickbait the fuck out of people or you're following stupid trends with that you don't really believe in, but you actually doing stuff. The way you want to, it's a it's a long grass, long process. So I can feel him on that because he's he wants to do stuff his way, but he's not getting the kickback from it. So by doing this, hopefully he can you know continue doing what he's doing and you know see the see the gains from doing it too, and have people who actually care about it, which makes sense. You know, ain't nothing wrong with that. At the end of the day, yeah. You know, and we have like things like ADS R and freaking Sonic Academy that are notorious for doing exactly what he's done and are very mm-hmm. successful from it. And I know they make money because I've done courses for ADSR. I haven't done any for uh, Sonic Academy, mm-hmm. but I've done courses in the past for ADSR, and they was quick to pay me that uh, that nice amount of money, uh, which yeah. at the end of the day, I thought to myself, like, okay, so they're paying me this. Like, some people don't think, like, oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. And I was like, I'm thankful. Shout out to ADSR. I'm thankful right. for it. But I'm like, man, it. how much money these these folks is making by doing yeah. these courses yeah cause i mean i remember i did two videos for them for their youtube channel they gave me a big i was like whoa for that's two, two videos like hmm y'all must be making bank in the back end like y'all right. have to be but yeah i mean it's, it's what it is so i mean yeah there's there's i mean it's always gonna be way i think like what he's doing like i said at the end of the day he's gonna have people who's gonna follow him his loyal supporters who's gonna follow him and, and like that and that's cool because he got them people you know and there's definitely gonna be people who's gonna look at him like oh man you know you're i'm not paying for information that's free on youtube and you know you got them people so some it, some people but the thing is a lot uh, like i said like again like a lot of those folks they get that information from other youtubers that are doing mm-hmm. this stuff like they like how many damn videos do i gotta fucking see uh, uh in dumb ones at that talking about counter melodies like for real man i just seen three more pop up like the other day oh like, man i can't wait to make mine it's coming I mean, this I, week baby I, I'm, I'm making one right there i'm making one right through you so we both we both have, we both have <laughs> counter melody video i think i made my ai video I'm, I'm, i just got a video talking about how ai make a, uh, uh all the ai plugins make a complete b i'm doing all kinds of stupid shit say fuck it i do it right but yeah it's like I don't know, man. It's it's, it's crazy, but right. Oh, you know. I, I, and somebody just mentioned Seamless. Oh my god! Like Seamless has had his whole entire channel. Like, like people were actually reposting this stuff, and and mm-hmm. you know, I mean, some of it for the greater good. Like, you know, they was retranslated in Russian. You know, so people could actually hear his knowledge because Seamless is a very knowledgeable guy. Yeah, but then you guy. have this asshole. I don't. I, I can't say if he's from the UK or not. But you got that asshole in the mix, Michael. That that literally gets all of his information from Seamless. <laughs> he took took videos from me and shit like that. And I got to sit there videos that I got like five thousand views on, like negative. <laughs> what? What? Nah. Like seventy seventy nine percent like and dislike. He gets like ninety eight percent, four hundred thousand. So he's you know people like that. Like that, yeah, out the mix, goddamn. But uh, <laughs> like he, like for real. <laughs> shout out, shout out to Leo for that. But Oof. like, you have, we have to deal with stuff like that from people like them that don't give a damn and they just want to take your content and then they're and then they're cashing out. And what yeah. we and what we what do we get from that? You know Nothing. what I'm saying? Just, just people when, when people finally see our videos. Oh, you copied this guy? Like, wait a minute, what? Nigga, look, look at the, the dates, look bro. At the dates. <laughs> like, come on. I hate what people do. They come and be, oh, man. Like, the other day, I was accused of being, not, no, not, see, we're talking about Curtis King. I was accused of being a dollar store Curtis King. I was like, wait a minute. Ooh, so, what if so me and Curtis King ever did video similar? Like, it's been similar. Like, <laughs> that is oh, fucked, up. fucked up. I'm like, so, uh, <laughs> like, what, what videos of mine and Curtis King actually go together? Like, I don't, I mean, not saying I, I got anything against Curtis King. I, Curtis King's a cool ass dude, but. Right. Our videos are completely different from each other. 
Yeah. But I'm different appeal like, at, at, I, I guess, I, and no, crazy because I had the, the camera angle in a different a different way, and now I'm just a dollar like, store. Like, 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 like you was like in the face of the camera. Yeah, I was like in the there. face, like talking, and like, oh, <laughs> now you this guy, now you him, now you're Av, now you're busy where beast, now you're Curtis King, now you're like, damn, can I? Okay, you know, I'm just gonna turn my camera off. Fuck it. But then, like, but then, but then, then like, you be oh, base cutter. Then copy this dude. <laughs> you be base you know, cutter. Gotta... <laughs> <laughs> <Like, shit. laughs> We can't live for shit, bro. Like real motherfucking man, talk, bro. I, I can't. It's like, man, everything I do is copying somebody. But I guess you know, or whatever. I'm, my, my name, my new name, I'm Mr. Same for now. I'm changing my channel, Mr. Same TV. There you go. <laughs> but but anyways, like uh, we'll just end that on, on that topic yeah. here. Yeah. You know? But good, good, best of luck to Curtis King. I hope it goes out playing. I'm pretty sure he's gonna he's gonna do good with it because he got a good following, and I'm pretty sure he's gonna get where he got to go with. So good, best of luck to him. Yeah. So. Um, I, I guess I guess we could kind of segue into what you had led us into because that was that happened on the same day I was telling you about the melody shit. Like, uh, <laughs> remember what I was telling you about? Uh, this dude had wrote me in an email, and let me let me, let me pull that email up. Let me get let me get <laughs> the facts. <laughs> but uh, it does it's, involve another YouTuber dead. here, and uh, you know I'm 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 neutral in this because I do feel the person that bought it and felt like he was uh, scammed. Uh, uh -oh. Well, two YouTubers at that, two popping YouTubers, by right. the way, because uh, I've seen their commercial, and when I saw the commercial, oh, I had an instant. Talk, no, please tell me you're not talking about the guy. No, no, we're not about to go there. Oh, let's go, let's go there. Fuck yeah, it, let's yeah go. no, we going there. Let's, let's go there. Let's go there. Yeah, I, I, I... <laughs> Let's, me, go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm, I'm slim budding today. I'm slim budding today. <laughs> Let's just get it. Right, right. We so we are in here. Email. I'm reading the email here. That so I just want to show people the email. So it was by uh, a zero a music group or whatnot. So that I don't end up being the bad guy. You definitely had to get your name references in this because they sent the story to me. I am just going to cover it, but all right. So the cut, uh, the story, and this is just in. It's not even in on the topics. But uh, he said, "I just wanted to tell you, I found out about the Unison Midi Pack. Uh, the main, <laughs> the main ad was promoted by Lifestyle and did it. The 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 new yeah, like popping kid. Um, which shout out to him, by the way. You know, I I seen this stuff." Uh, yeah. But anyways, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I did. It. So he said, "Um." Here is what he said. It's, it's, whoa, this this is written very bad. But uh, I sent him just letting you know uh, that I cor I am correct. You and your team won't get looked at sideways for this craziness. Whoa, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. So this is really exclusive here. This is really exclusive here. So apparently, let me let me read this again. Just wanted to tell you that uh, tell you what I just found out about the Unison Mini Pack. The main ad was promoted by Lifestyle Did It. So here is what I sent him. Just letting you know if I if I am correct, you and your team won't get looked at sideways for this craziness. Okay. At first, I thought he said that he made it and they just like lifted the shit. Oof. Uh, so he wrote uh, Lifestyle. He said, uh, I, I saw your YouTube uh, ad for Unison. So I went and purchased the product after, uh, after purchasing it. I added to my MIDI collection instead of copying my C CPU. Asked if I if I wanted to skip or replace or cancel. Oh, so basically, Ooh. they they, they still what? in wrong with the internet Ooh. man that's, that's, that's why that's why people can't really do shit man because shit like Ooh. this like <laughs> i did not read that i did not mm. read that all the way i thought what i thought he was saying is that you know why are they all right so we're just gonna continue with this when i double check i found out i purchased this midi kit from free scales cords on six five 2018 uh shaking my damn head soon after i emailed unison and told them about 
they got snappy with me and gave me full refund. These guys basically took an exact same MIDI collection from somebody else, added a few things, and just renamed it. Now I don't know if they are connected with that company, but it seems pretty shaky to me. I just wanted to let you know just because a lot of people saw your ad on YouTube for this and don't want you to get a bad name. Here is the website. And then, you know, shows the website. I'm not about to get no free pub to somebody like that. But no, anyways. <laughs> but st- and, uh, that's what we talked about maybe earlier. We were, earlier this week. We were talking about how people selling bullshit like that, man, for one. That's that's a bullshit product. I don't care what nobody say. That's the dumb, that's the dumbest product I've ever seen. I hate seeing that commercial. Really? It pissing me the fuck off. Every time I see that damn commercial, tell me some Guess what, everybody? Hey, this is the best core pack ever. Pack ever. It teaches you the core. It teaches you the cores. All you do is throw it in there. It teaches you exact bitch. Go to fucking FL Studio. Go to the piano roll and hit scale helper. Now you go. Now you're on all the right, cores for right. free. And, you and, buy- and I guess I'm not a part of the cool kids, my dude. You know what I mean? Oh. Even though I've covered this so many damn times, I even told people that you should go to FL Studio 12.3 or higher, or mm-hmm. at least be in FL Studio 20. Fuck 11. And just use that because you have a scale helper built in there and you can make as much as you want and make as many dope melodies as possible. Yeah, well, well you don't you, you honestly don't need a scale or anything else like that because it's built inside FS Studio. Hell it's built inside Studio One. Hell it's built inside Ableton. Right. Hell it's built inside Logic. What the fuck you need to buy a MIDI pack for? A MIDI core pack for? <laughs> Yeah, like, the, like, come on, yeah, y'all, they, 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 this shit pissed me out because, like, they take your hard earned people's money over <laughs> bullshit. Like, like I said, you know what? For now on, I'm selling goddamn. I told, hey, I'm gonna start selling template packs. I'm gonna start selling. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna start selling you FL Studio. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna start selling FL Studio template packs. Like, they just, they just open, they just open FL Studio. I'm gonna sell the, um, I'm gonna sell all the packs to all your favorite demos. Put them on sales. I put every demo to every DAW. I'm, I'm repacking. Pack been, I'm, re- I'm repacking every last one of FL Studio stock yeah. sales to sell them shits and say TMA eight exactly. users. Exactly. Just because I have that clout. Yeah, Captain yeah, I'm, Clout I'm, I'm, Chaser. I'm, 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 I'm pack. I'm packaging the at save file, the save ass file. I'm, I'm repackaging everything, man. Don't, don't, the, the boy about, the boy about to get it. I'm about to get that dot uh, untitled file. I'm repackaging that. I mean, shit. I mean, I mean, if we if we gonna if we gonna go ahead and start reselling cord packs like that from other people for one, and on top of that stuff that people need to know, man, I'm, I'm just selling everything, bro. Like don't don't play, don't play. Man, Shit. listen, I must rather see. I must rather these dudes actually take some of my scale videos and and redo them. Okay, it's girl, not like hey, they girl. haven't done them before. <laughs> but I'm, I'm just sorry. saying. <laughs> but <laughs> I, mean, I, I must rather. And shout out to Busy Work Beats, by the way, for being at least being original. Goddamn! Shout out to shout Busy out to Work Beats, Beats for Beats doing some original, original shit. Original goddamn original. it! But exactly, <laughs> like for real, like his, 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 and his stuff is actually gems. Now I, I give it to Busy Work, but you know what we're talking about. But like I said, you have people who don't want to. Who, who I mean, the, the the knowledge is there. Take the knowledge and make your own work with the knowledge. Don't just copy paste. Come on, man! It's, it's not that hard. It's not that hard. Like, <laughs> damn. Well, I mean, I'm I'm, I'm heated, man. It pissed me off. If I I swear to if I if I go to YouTube today and see that damn commercial again, I'm a flip. Cause I see it every single that's, day at least once. There's a couple of commercials on uh, YouTube. Even <laughs> even the uh, the Waze one. <laughs> I mean, Uh-oh. hey, but even hey, the hey, Waze one was kind of getting on my nerves. But at least hey. it was genuinely thoughtful, well produced. Like the fucking uh, <laughs> superhero one. Like okay, I was, was like, funny. oh my was, god, like, that was funny. that was goofy as hell. Like, wait, y'all need to chill out. Y'all, y'all doing too much. <laughs> like, <laughs> like for real, for real. Like that was uh, that was a, a really good one. Uh, by ways, you know, no no bias yeah. or anything. <laughs> I, 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 like, I like ways. Now they gave me that that sale. Man, I bought like two, twenty damn plugins. Uh, so uh, I can't. Well, I can't... <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. I saw I saw MG and M. I'm glad. I'm glad they 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 enjoyed that sale. I mean, I enjoyed it my damn self because there was some. I had somebody, I I had somebody uh, mad at me because of that sale. Cause I, I put a video about it. Dude, like, no, how the hell are you gonna say that that sale is twenty nine dollars for all plugins? Oh my god. That, I think everybody that uh, that talked about like, it, even like, even uh, Craftsman said, uh, uh, he said that that he got attacked for it, and then a, yeah. a couple other people in the ways forum got attacked for it. And because uh, people took it wrong, like they, they, they the some, bundles. I, some some idiot <laughs> thought that I was saying if you go to Ways and pay twenty nine dollars, you get all their plugins. In what <laughs> fucking universe you living in? Yeah, yeah, subscription based. They should do that while you're they playing. Do, they do. 
twenty dollars for subscription. They got it. Pay oh. as you go. I think. I think it's pay as you go. Yeah, but they don't. They don't have like the 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 sexy stuff like the Mercury. Oh, and, yeah, it's like it's like yeah. it's like the, the stuff you get in that that subscription makes my like I don't want that. Right. That ain't. There's there's two plugins that are dope in there, but everything else is like nah, I don't want that. But yeah, I got I got everything I want off Waze until they release something new. So I'm good. I'm good on Waze for a while. Right, right, right. But yeah, but just back to the whole fact. Yeah, it just it's just. People are selling dumb shit, but I, we shouldn't even. Let's just move on because we're gonna be we can be on it all day. Yeah, let's move, let's move yeah, yeah. That, that was the break. That was the break. And I, uh, you, if you wouldn't have reminded me, I would have let that shit go. But I was gonna talk about it in another video again. And I might as well. I think I'm gonna make it my duty just to recycle what I talk about that gets the most views because somebody else is gonna do it, and they're probably gonna get double the views anyway. So. But yeah, I'm, it's no hate towards like because uh, I, I saw Savita. Savita is in that commercial. And you know, yeah. Savita is a good dude uh, for what it's worth, and he obviously has the movement at the at the moment, and I'm Le I'm cool with that. At least and he changed the at least he changed the melodies up and everything like that in his little commercial. He actually chopped it up and made it completely different, but, but still, yeah. But at the cute. end of the day, it's available to you. As a matter of fact, you can do that in FL Studio 11 for the eleven the eleven heads that are getting uh, getting exposed by this whole entire thing. Yeah, didn't didn't Base Gutter make a video about that? You see it? Like, yeah, Base Gutter made a, a dope ass video about. It. But you know what? Yeah. You know, people people do whatever. Um, can't knock the hustle, I guess. I, uh, I mean, niggas got hey, a scam to get rich these days, right? I mean, can't, yes, it, can't it, just it, be good. Still, yeah, steal from others and make money off somebody else's creation. Because you know, nowadays nobody nobody wants to put in the effort to be creative. Right, right, that's right. how it is. So yeah, just stay creative, do your thing, and you'll be good. I guess we should move on to the first flex we talking about today. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, 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 no, you no. did. No, you oh. did. I got some. I got some words about. It. I'm, I'm making a video about that plugin too. By the way, so I will make a full video about it coming next week. But uh, I don't know. <laughs> no, you did. <laughs> but anyways, yeah. let's go ahead yeah. and get there. So, yeah. all right, FL Studio this week they dropped uh, the Flex Beta, and <laughs> this right here was is actually was a surprise to me, and I have not downloaded it yet. You got to have uh, twenty point one point two beta uh, to get the the Flex yeah. Beta or whatnot. Now. Right. I guess I, I should read it or whatnot. Let's see if my, my English or my reading skills have improved in, in the last seconds. But uh, FL Studio <laughs> 20, 20. 20.1.2 beta. I already fucked up. Introduces Flex, a new instrument plugin by... Oh, damn. Oh, boy. I'm really messed up. For Mac and Windows. Uh, coming free with the next official release of FL Studio. Why not try Flex beta today and let us know what you think? And the discussion thread for all those people that are like, you know, well, you can, I will be covering this because I'm interested. Um, so I guess I'll go ahead and play uh, the preview of it or whatnot while we got good bandwidth. Well, the preview is not really. <laughs> that shit sound good. Yeah, it does. I ain't gonna lie about that, but. Mm. I, I kind of want to cook up. Okay, you know, they're typical EDM bullshit. Yeah, because I mean, that's FFS, dude. They don't care about the hip hop community. You know that. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but, um, and, 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 that's what I, and that's what I don't. That's what I don't like about Flex. I ain't not gonna lie. That's what I don't like about Flex that it's not intended. Well, actually, I, I take it back. Hip hop and trap producers, we get one pack in there. It's called Eight Oh Eights. It's like something Eight Oh Eights. It's in there. They have they they got a full Eight Oh Eight pack. That's the only thing we get. That's all we get. So we don't get mad and say this ain't for us. They say they give us an Eight Oh Eight pack, which is basically it sounded like it was it was serum Eight Oh Eights anyway. But oh shit. But, 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 but I see what they're doing. I see what they're doing. They're trying to make a Nexus. Compared, I mean, you know, because a lot of people like Nexus, right? Right. So I think this is their this is their way of saying, hey, we got a Nexus for FL Studio. Stop downloading Nexus and this old Nexus stuff. Hey, we got Flex now. It's Nexus because it's the same thing. You can't make sounds for it. You can only buy sounds for it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Got him. Got him. I need I need a sound bite for that. <laughs> got <Exactly>. him. <laughs> yeah, God damn. So I mean, it's, that's what it's basically just a rompler. It's basically just a, it's, it's Nexus inside of FS Studio now, and that's what they're going for. Which I mean, if they can bring some nice organic orchestral stuff to it, I mean, Perhaps, I, maybe. But then the price—I want to know what the price is going to be. I ain't check out the store, so I don't know what the price is going to be like. So we we'll have to see, man. I mean, it's 
when I, when I played around with it, I was like, okay, it's yeah. If I have Nexus, or I don't have Nexus, but you know, if I if I was using Nexus and it has some good sound compared to that, I could see it being a good. Plus, it's good CPU usage because it's in FL Studio, so yeah. it's, it's it's really good on CPU, which I like that. Okay, but, you know, but at the same time, it's like eh, this just Nexus, just the looks better. It looks better. That's all it is. It's, yeah. it's, it's, just, it's just a better looking Nexus. Well, when it comes to my input, when it, when I talk about like FL Studio or Image Lines plugins, their plugins are always been good. I mean, come on, man, gross yeah. beat. I, I'm still fighting off the trolls in the the. Uh, don't, you don't need gross beat to half speed and all this stuff, and you know, even though half time and slow mo do more than just the half speed stuff. Uh, it can go, get slower, you know. They're like, well, well, what about this and what about that? And I'm like, you know what, fuck it. But yeah, I still like I still like half time. I'm yeah, I, mean, I, I just bought the the slow mo and reverse based off your video. I'm gonna try it out myself. So mm, we'll see if I like it too. I mean, I don't care if it does a job. It does a job. And it does it a different way. But yeah, uh, yeah, go ahead, my bad. <laughs> oh, no, no, it's all good. <laughs> like, and then you know, Gross Beat being one of the more legendary plugins uh, mm -hmm. that they they've made. Harmer being another one. That yep. was actually the one that really got me to like and solidify me into wanting to do more sound design, and it's an awkward one at that. Citrus, uh, a dope, Citrus got some dope stuff, you know. If you like, if it's innocent, it's super powerful. Yeah, but it's, it's good, confusing. very confusing too. At the same yeah. time, I don't like the operating system. That's, that's uh, the thing about operator it's, it's, system. It's, it's one of the most powerful FN synthesizers out there, but it's just confusing as fuck. But it's, it can do some watch seamless. <laughs> yeah, right, right. Uh, wait, uh, yeah, seamless. Hold your beer for them to rip your damn FM synthesis videos, because I already know in the mix is looking at your channel right now. I'm going to steal <laughs> this video next. Control C, Control V. Bam. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna write the script for everything the damn seamless tell her. <laughs> <laughs> bitch ass motherfucker. Oh, but, I can't stand that dude, man. But yeah, I mean, but flex. It, it looks like it looks like they're going in there. I see where they're going with it because they're trying to. Because you know, we already know. Let's be that's elephant in the room. A lot of people torn FL Studio, right? So they're like, oh, let's make a plugin where if you want to be able to use it to its full potential, you got to pay for the the sounds at least. So if you oh, do okay. Demo, so, I, I remember you was talking about it might be subscription based or some shit. Uh, I think it's well. Right now, I see it has a store where you can actually buy packs. But I'm, I'm pretty. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking like they might go to a subscription based something like that to kind of you know help make it a little more enticing for people. Yeah, let's get the low down you know, dirty on this. Let's let's know, visit the the form, you know, because you know this is something that people never visit because they don't own fucking <laughs> license for FL Studio. If, if, if you don't have an FL Studio license, you can't get on the form. You can't download this stuff. It's, it's sad. You, you wait for that wait for that crack on on cheekybreaky dot com. Yeah, you got damn you know, torn file, some bitch. Virus. <laughs> Oh shit! So all right, so notes here. It says uh, the manual says flex includes subtractive, wave table, multi sample, FM and AM based synthesis. So it's more mm -hmm. on the lines of uh, not Nexus, but damn Electra. It's, 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 it's everything, but like I say you can't make your own sounds from it. From what I for what I play with right now, I haven't been able to make my own sounds. Oh okay, like, okay, okay. So but but like I said you you pick a sound and it has different macros and stuff like that to the sound, so you can shape the sound, but you don't create the sound itself. You just can manipulate the sounds. And then they got them few little packs right there. And like I said, like there's mobile tune 808s. They have an 808 pack in there, which I'm like, come on, bro. That come yeah. on, you can make like a hip hop bank or something like that. Just just one would make, make people happy or trap bank. Well, what the hell? Like I need to oh, I guess I have to log in again. Yeah, you're not gonna be yeah, you never be able to see that you log uh, in. I know and people are like, oh well you was just talking about that. <laughs> nah, oh, trust no. me. FL uh, FL are, went to my channel. They ain't they ain't went to these other motherfuckers' channels that's popping, but they went to mine, goddamn it. Oh, he got his black ass got them eighteen thousand subscribers. <laughs> let, it, it, let me let me not play image it, line like that, like they don't fuck with black people. I need to stop the, that that day. Yeah, I know. They just, they just don't <laughs> fuck with the community, the, the trap community. Everyone focus on the EDM community. Yeah, they, they, they fuck, they fuck with Metro Boomer's ass. <laughs> oh yeah, one guy, yeah, one guy. And Carnage. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> make it way louder. <laughs> but, I, still got the I still got the Carnage fattener in my in my in my plugins. Right. <laughs> 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 so 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 they have some wear and care for us a little bit so yeah i think i think if like i say if they, if they add some more 
more realistic sounds. I think it adds some orchestral sounds like that to it. I think it could be dope. It'd be it'd be a good competitor to Nexus. I think it would be because it'd be inside FL Studio, better on CPU usage. You ain't got to crack it if you own FL Studio. And then you know, hopefully the packs would be a lot cheaper than Nexus packs because them things are fucking expensive. Like Nexus, the full version of Nexus. I don't know if this still costs over three thousand dollars. Well, yeah, to get every one of the packs or whatnot, yeah, yeah, it's, that's, yeah Nick, that's Nick, just not gonna ever happen yeah. by me. Uh, no, that's that's so, no. like the more I indulge in playing with real instruments, the less I care about like VST plugins, unless they're like certain ones to, about mixing, which would be like Waves takes care of that. Nice Waves is nice to take care to take care of everything that I I really love as far as like mm-hmm. engineering. Some some VST plugins, of course, you know, Electra. I gotta be Electra gang all day, and then yeah. Harmer will be is the is the uh, the end game for me there. So added the synthesis. That's what you're trying to get into. I see. I feel you. I feel you. Yeah. So let me let me log in. Let me. <laughs> boy, my shit to say something else. I'm gonna I'm gonna kill this boulder flugger. Oh. <laughs> okay. Yeah, there we, we go. We, 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 we in there. We, we in there. there. That's why that's why he able to gang now. <laughs> We don't. We see why he able to gain that. He, he don't own it. Man. Nah, we in there. We logged in. But uh, <laughs> I just want to see this here. Okay, so they just show you flex and damn, you had to log in just to see the the pictures. Holy crap! What well, they yeah, they, man. <laughs> they don't play. Don't play. Ooh. So all right. So what what did this guy? Uh, post he posted this right here so he show he show how to refresh it and everything because yeah when i first did that, i was like how the hell you find a fucking flex and see like look at all them flexes on there it's like the cpu's just on this mm. ridiculous i'm ready to cook up man i'm ready ridiculous. to cook up with that shit I that, will. Thing, that thing don't hit nothing like you have a crappy computer thing because like i say it's built inside fl studio so you know it's gonna run like a champ yeah. that's why that's what everybody likes you know that's, that's definitely dope okay so it says uh confusion by the name filters master filter Okay, he just misspelled shit. Okay, uh, that's just somebody asking a question. I'm, I'm not gonna. It's like for, forum uh, fodder is just the worst. So yeah, <laughs> filters, a master filter, rare filter. Well, what is a master filter? What is uh? The, the master filter is the filter you put on the whole thing. The other filter is create a filter and blah. It's just, it's, it's, it's goofy. Let's like say in the, but the macros are pretty dope. Um, I just, <laughs> like I said, it needs more sounds. I just, I thought it was gonna be so I could create my own sounds with, which I was hoping that would've been dope. But yeah. I thought, just you know, I'll show you guys, let you guys make your own opinions about it. When you guys yeah. get it, you can make your own opinions. I'm just, you know, I'm just gonna showcase. It. I don't really care. I'm, I'm not gonna use it probably. If I do, it'd be so luck. I mean, it'd just be me just fucking around, or if I get a challenge or something like that. I don't know. <laughs> uh, uh, Rye, he he was like uh, Omni Sphere all day, man. Uh, yeah, I think mean, about it. Yeah, I know. That's exactly what I was going to say. Thank you for taking the words out of my mouth. And then you got Nexus. We was just talking about Nexus is, you know, 250 bucks just to get like some some of the stuff. They give you a little bit and then they have your basic stuff. Of course, you don't have any control of those sounds. And we already know how uh, popular Nexus is with the trap Mm -hmm. based community. So, you know, it is what it is. Uh, And and I think that's why they made Flex. I think they're trying to get they're trying to give them, you know, they're trying to get the they're trying to get people in the FSD to make one fighting in there. But um, yeah, they, they're trying to get that that community. They're trying to get that that rap hip hop track community in there. So we're like, hey, we'll, we'll make you this. You know what I'm saying? Uh, That's what it is. Do so, not man. post any uh, pirate torrent sites in my chat. You will be kicked from it. I'm not playing. I am tired of goddamn getting flagged and my channel getting a bad rep because people want to sit there and be funny. Uh, but anyways, uh, yeah, I mean, Nexus, Nexus is pretty good to me, but uh, I, I don't have to live by it. Back in the day, you know, then, oh, Hypersonic. Hypersonic 2 was the way for a, a oh, that was, minute. Oh, that used to be the shit. Right. The shit back in the day. I mean, boy, that impurity. What? <laughs> right, uh, right. Them used to be the sounds back then. I mean, I remember, I remember having them, but yeah, we... We ought to move from that. <laughs> but yeah, um, what else were we, we was talking about? Uh, I guess we was going to, ha- I had another topic here. Let's see. Um, flexing for social media. This is, of course, of the, course flexing the flexing edition, flexing. Easter Sunday. Hey, get him with the flex. Get him with the flex. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all remember that? I don't yeah. know if I remember that. <laughs> Damn, I barely remember that. And that was like around in my time here. But <laughs> the, all right, so. Flexing on social media, that kind of goes again into what what we was talking about with Curtis King and 
and you know certain other people that just I I just really just just want to slap the shit out of, but <clears throat> you know internet <laughs> uh, prevents a lot of things. But anyway, so uh, a lot of a lot of talk about flexing and all that. Uh, then I, of course, when we was over there at the podcast, again, shout out to MG The Future and Craftsman for their podcast earlier. They was talking about the exact same thing. I was like, right. damn, I thought I was the only person to see that shit. Uh, you know, people uh, were uh, being, when, when when they are like exposed to critical thought, like thought that actually matters. <laughs> like things like you know, the, the relativity uh, of giving credit to people, you know, the history of stuff, you know, people always want to kind of uh, say, you know, the people that don't care, the culture vultures don't care ever. Um, and, and again, guys, a clarification on the culture vulture thing is, is not just a, oh, well, if you are a white guy and you just don't appreciate hip, uh, yeah. hip everything historical and hip, well, that is a culture vulture, uh, but you, you can be any color and hit and and mm-hmm. be a culture vulture uh, in a nutshell. You know, it's not just based off somebody's skin tone. No, uh, a lot of people uh, usually attack people and say culture vulture, and usually the the end of that usually is like a white guy or some shit. But there are white people, and I repeat that know more history of hip hop than black folks. I know this for yep. a fact here. Yep, that's um, true. And you know, the thing is about flexing on social media and that, that it was talking about was people that, uh, and I get to be the butt of the joke and it's because of this picture right here. <laughs> oh, no, no. <laughs> so I got my other guitar out here and I'm going to go ahead and play. So I don't look like I'm flexing, but nah, I just, um, but what, <laughs> but yeah, you know, people have a tendency to do that. And I actually put that, that picture out for a reason because I want people to, to challenge me. I, I want the guys that that claim that they're doing so much great stuff and all that and they're not really doing much for for anything other than just selling them your drum kits and and preset banks and shit like that with, with their video there are multiple millions of videos where they don't show you how to make that stuff but you know Everybody after <laughs> after a while after a while, you know, when, when, when we put the information out there, they they carbon copy that some bitch and try to remix it a little bit. But mm-hmm. yeah, yeah, oh boy, I yeah. challenge any of those people that want to say uh, I can't play the guitar. I was flexing for social media. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the the homies over there uh, definitely MG, and you know, because I for those who don't know, I've talked to MG, and of course I've talked to Craftsman and, and everybody else. They pretty much know my historical abilities when it comes to music. If you haven't watched. If you're not engaged with any of my videos, which I don't do much, uh, I always pre-make the be- uh, the beats now because nobody really cares for that ever. <laughs> 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 but anyways, <clears throat> but you know, I-, I was just talking about you know certain things. People saying uh, that you know you're you're flexing because uh, oh no no no, it's no point of me even even doing this. It. It's it's in the comment section here. Um, but yeah, I was just talking about just like changing things up, just doing different things and then just, you know, relearning because I'm not going to say I'm the best. I'm no Slash. I'm no Rick James. I'm no damn Jimi Hendrix on no damn guitar. No Kenny Rogers. <laughs> no Tracy Chapman. None of that. Right. I'm, I'm just a beginner. Uh, I can, But I can play a little bit. But yeah, uh, uh, Hawk in Asia, he was talking about the whole black culture thing. And, you know, I was just telling him uh, my point in hand in that. Uh... But yeah, you know, just talking about the therapy of that. Oh, here it goes. And I think uh, Celebrity Boy, you know, he, I, I mean, a thousand f- subscribers. I think he's just really trying to get his numbers up and talk shit. Uh, and he might, and I didn't really get too offended. But then again, I did hit his ass with a paragraph. He said, uh, this nigga trying to follow Curtis King wave. <laughs> hey, I, hey, I'm a dollar, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a dollar store Curtis King. So, hey, you trying to follow me? I'm a dollar store Curtis King. <laughs> right. You know so, right. I mean, hey, that, I was like, bro, come on. That's the best you can come up with with your 40 subscribers. And, and Boo 20. on the beat. What's good, my nigga? <laughs> no. Like, I'm not trying to throw numbers out there. I, don't, I hate to compare that to numbers, but it's like, yeah, man, like, like what? Why, when you're doing something, how, why is it always copying somebody when you're literally doing it for yourself? Right. I don't, I don't get that. That's, right. It's obvious know. that my videos aren't hitting at this time right now. But yeah, I mean, 
But you, you're doing good. What you talking about? Oh, no, 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 no. This month, ooh, God. If I pull up the channel I, uh, I do right now, shit. <laughs> I, I'm, doing, I'm, doing, I'm doing all right. I don't really care about the viewers. As long as I get the information out there and help people out, that's yeah. all I'm good with. Yeah, I, I, I do care about the analytics. I, 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 I'm not going to front. I, I think that if I put out a video, especially the amount of time that I edit and all that stuff, and it yep. only gets like, it doesn't even break a thousand views within that day. And that's just me being nice. At 40,000 40, subscribers, I should I should be get, at least getting like, you would think, like 5K views. But I do know channels that have over 200K subscribers and they put out very good co uh, content like continuously, but certain videos hit. That's why when I look at some other people's channels, uh, and, and Curtis King included, like he he gets like six thousand or whatnot. That like that's realistic. Uh, but somebody getting twenty thousand views in a day and something like that, that's not realistic. That's, that's yeah. fake, in my opinion. But uh, uh what was you gonna say, brother? I say yeah, the um, them Zeus players ain't ain't adding up. No, no, them the SM Zeus, Zeus, them Zeus players ain't adding up. Yeah, man, I, I feel you though. Like I say, I mean, and also it's, it's YouTube doing this thing once again. YouTube going through his whole stage of doing the same thing they always do every year they have a problem blah 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 it's fucking up shit they're trying to fix the algorithm trying to change it it's just what it is it happens every fucking year so it's, just, it's it's one of the things that happens and time down slowly gets back to where it should be but it fucks up again because somebody gonna fuck it up for everybody again well, well shit like uh last month i was raping this motherfucker from you 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 me and it's like yeah like i said for youtube doing this it's going through that change once again like every fucking year they always go through this stupid change that fucks up for everybody it's like and people are like whoa youtube get your shit together like we're, we're working on it right now we're you know we're, 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 we're. like no nah, y'all know what the fuck eating, going on not playing they probably they Same probably they're, they're either slaving hard as a some bitch or or they are laxed in a motherfucker just in there just having all kinds of youtube orgies and some shit <laughs> Uh, we're a fucking bitch. We don't give a fuck about these, these little content creators. Hope they get off our channel anyway. Makes new people come in. Boy, we are all as hell on Easter Sunday. Holy <laughs> shit. But it's, 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 it's just the real. This is how the trap tuna podcast should be every week. <laughs> every week. Fucking turned up. Yo, like, but the thing is that the thing that I have a, a big <laughs> issue with. <laughs> I can't, man. But the, but the thing I have a big issue with is just like. You know, last month I was bad consistent, like bad consistent on a lot of things. Now I could argue one could one could argue like my content this month has been uh, lacking as far as titles and maybe pers. <laughs> I'm trying to look at the chat, man, but uh, <laughs> and, and lacking on a, a whole bunch of stuff that that could be approved. Like, but like, come on, man, like a 40k subscriber base channel barely getting a thousand views in a day like that shit is disrespectful as hell bruh <laughs> and, and, and youtube is doing it too that's the press the problem youtube is doing it and they fucking up something that's messing with everybody seeing our videos and i was like come on like because usually we get like a good bit and it's like damn like what y'all what button y'all pressing back that y'all shouldn't be pressing stop doing it right not flipping, not flipping that damn switch leave it alone David. it says do not touch for a reason i have people been mad as fuck but that's how YouTube is, man. So hopefully they get the shit together and all. But I, I, if I understand, if I see why a lot of people are leaving YouTube or thinking of the ways of, you know, doing their thing, yeah. you know, but at the same time, it's like, yeah. it's and YouTube, I'm not though. leaving. Like, come on, man. If, if, if anything, like, why would I cop, copy Curtis King and leave? Like, I have far less of influence uh, than uh, yeah. Curtis King. Like, <laughs> I have far less influence than Curtis King. I've achieved less than Curtis King. Why would I try to do the exact type of subscribe? Like, I personally think almost everybody should follow that suit, but that probably won't work for everybody. And I would, and myself included, especially if I started off doing stuff like that before. And he's, at matter of fact, like Curtis King is, was selling courses beforehand. Like he was selling FS Studio courses beforehand. Like he, he was doing, he was, he was uh, one of the, the few people that were selling courses. So it would be normal for people to actually continue to buy his stuff. So, you know, it was a luxury for everybody to be able to see him on there. Oh, no, nah, I'm not, I'm not leaving. I'm, I'm not going to oh. leave, man. But no, I, yeah, no, seeing somebody like around. him of his gigantuous, uh, uh, community, which is, it, it hurts the fact that he would, uh, leave, which I don't think he's 100% leaving. I just think he just, he's, he's going to do he, 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 he said, he said himself that he's going to do like, 
for YouTube, he's going to do like just the funny playing around videos. Mm -hmm. While his serious stuff is going to be on his subscription model, which makes sense. He, he'll do like, I think he said something about he don't he only do sample stuff. Can it be chopped or some sample stuff like that? So that way, he if he get demonetized, he don't really care because he got a subscription thing, which makes sense. I mean, yeah, cool. I feel so. Yeah, that's that's how that's where he's going. He's going to still be on YouTube doing random stuff yeah. but he's gonna be his main focus is gonna be his subscription model which you know yeah. what you want to do with it, especially if people are paying for it they expect you know you to come 100 percent with it like if i'm paying for something when i log into that bitch it better have some some dope production some dope videos some dope information i'm gonna be like damn which i'm pretty sure it's curtis king so i'm pretty sure he's gonna do that anyway yeah i don't doubt the man's skill or that what he's capable of yeah i but will yeah. do courses now like like I'm, but i'm not gonna just 100 just give up on a, something that i poured so much uh, love in yeah. like this like i've i got over thousands of videos like you know what i'm saying like he had i think he think he had did over almost 13 what thousand videos or something uh, like he, that? he said about 50 he said fifteen thousand, which i i barely scratched a thousand yeah i'm, I'm like i made like 900 ish oh you're at eight eight hundred and some videos i just I oh, checked wait. earlier there you go. So say I ain't I, when I hit a thousand, I'm gonna have a big celebration and jump around and do a backflip for yeah. y'all break my damn back. So so he I'm is more up. more I, I respect him even more knowing that because like only other person I know that that shits out videos outside of like me is like busy work beats and MG <laughs> the future and, that must, that, that, <laughs> and Busy Work Beats, man. He, he's a he's a whole new beast. He's a he's a he's a different animal when it comes to videos. That motherfucker shits videos for breakfast, man. Right. <laughs> talk, about, talk about he I, I have problems finishing my video. I like Negro. <laughs> How you, okay, you have problems your video. You got twenty damn video dropping in one day. Uh, what? Get out of here, Busy. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, why that happened? <laughs> and man, that man killed me, but he be he be in there pumping up. I think I think I literally think he do like ten views a day. He could be and sweating had, this had, shit. Had, <laughs> be, be, he's he's his own sweatshop. Yeah, he's, all, he's, he's all, <laughs> busy work beat sweat. That boy got a damn he got a damn machine that whips him every time he don't finish a video. I don't know. That, <laughs> that motherfucker, but he be on it. He be fucking on it. <laughs> <laughs> damn! Yo. Shout, shout, shout out to busy though. He putting in work though. Ah damn! I, and I wish I could do that shit. I can't do it. Mm -mm. I'm doing for work. a vacation, I, bro. Well, y'all, I man, my vacation's up. My vacation's up. I'm coming back next week, so I got three videos done. I had to force my, I had to punch myself, to do it, force it to do it, but it work. <laughs> they coming. Right. So you know, just just all all jokes aside, like you know that to me. Now when I look at uh, people like that, that you know put in that much work they deserve that x amount of views and whatnot and mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying and it's just a lot of stuff that's very suspect these days like i i, I see yeah. far too many videos that aren't even close to like if you probably wouldn't even click on it if it wasn't them saying type beat this and type beat that and when you look at it it's just like what the fuck like you know damn well that these niggas ain't and like they know nothing of what they talk about like but it's, it's another thing we see people giving out quality information these people just doing troll videos like you said like tight beat stuff and all that which no wrong with that if you're doing a tight beat but you're actually showing the process and all that yeah but you're just like yeah tight beat beat already been made you're just overlaying the video shit and not really showing how to not show your screen or anything like that's like right fuck, what, what you used to make that sound yeah. Oh, oh no! I'm I'm definitely gonna do some type beat videos just oh, just cause struggle I'm, right here. Struggle beats, I, I'm you know <laughs> it, it's like why it and, and it puts us in the predicament to do that the way that YouTube works and stuff like that the whole flexing thing it's just like you have to do fucking content like that to survive and it's the fucking worst type of feeling in the world uh, to be able to like. The fact that you know you have all these subscribers and they won't all of them won't receive the video and so you got to survive off of the search bar SEO and all that and and, and you got to take advantage of that and then they then they was talking about how they calculate uh, the the algorithm calculates you know if if they should serve that to your subscribers or serve that to recommendations and it's like yeah. what. They were they were looking at some new thing like they were looking at like your performance as a creator like they were looking at a new algorithm they were they're testing it out to where it sees how active you are on their channel and depending on how active you are that depends on how you prep and search and all this I'm like what they can't do that because people got lies outside of YouTube bro you can't that, like not everybody there are people who just live in a dungeon and do YouTube all day long there are those people. That's facts but there's some people who actually have real legit lies you can't do something like that. that's gonna fuck up everybody not a lot of people. 
Yeah, and Bo- Bufu guys. just uh, just left a comment too. He's like, I imagine YouTube also must get uh, political pressure to avoid certain content, and they'll probably go uh, with it to avoid the governmental uh, regulations. Uh, them cutting into their part of the pie. Um, well, yeah, yeah, the conspiracy videos. I mean, I, I I'm not a fan of like the uh, like. Oh, Jay Z just had a ch- they Jay Z and Beyonce just had a child. I know that don't got nothing to do with politics, but like a conspiracy video like that, <laughs> and they have to sacrifice this person to have their child. On you know what I'm saying? Like that shit, like that is like what? Like and, and there's people that are like in the and it kills me too because the comment section is like uh like they pile up with oh yes he's right yeah they sacrificed the lamb the other day I saw it yeah, like, they got the goat's blood and poured it on their body and swam in the belt the, the enemies and people they're like come the fuck <laughs> on man get the yes they took a part of Kanye shit. West's brain and fed it to Kim Kardashian so they can have their child I'm like, like what I'm not like man they, they, this, this computer, yeah, that's that <laughs> shit like that yeah get that shit off YouTube that shit's just gonna make people feel fucking yeah. Low your IQ anyway, yeah. but yeah, I mean, and they, and they are not gonna. They're just like uh, the like real news or whatnot. Like, uh, well, whatever you would consider new, like it's ABC real news, <laughs> news or CNBC. They're not gonna. They're not gonna suffer from from anything that has to do with YouTube. They they're considered legit news sources, and that that actually plays into the whole Article Thirteen thing, because I mean they lined up with the lobbyists, and you know it's I don't know. I, that really doesn't. Aff- I'm not really worried about that part of of YouTube attacking me because I'm all I'm doing is tutorials. I'm just trying to teach stuff uh, about uh, music and stuff like that. I mean, that really doesn't affect like what we're what we're doing over here. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Unless, unless like we're just like constantly attacking people, it's like it gets a little old to, to like say say you know either, either y'all gonna realize that some of these people are, are just straight up fuck boys. And that oh, that's all they do, or they're not. And and people with community, anyways, they're gonna go and socially identify with the person that looks the nearest, closest to them. Um, not to, not to say that they ain't uh, like like white people that watch my channel. Uh, like you know what I'm saying? Because it's obviously white people that watch my channel. I got a lot of white homies and stuff like that. Most of them over from overseas. Uh, but I'm overseas, everybody <laughs> but, overseas watching. But, Tune in. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Shout, shout out to all my my oh, European my and man. all my Asian oh, my peoples, all my Australian peoples, peoples, all of our peoples. What is good? South America, what's happening? Central America. I'm a dark over there, right? The time zone, hell yeah. I'm time and, over there. and like uh, like West Coast white people, I I love you all. <laughs> I love, and, I, I love, and my East Coast I, white folks too. I ain't gonna say. <laughs> I, I love everybody. This 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 is a mixed household. So I love everybody. I don't, I don't see I don't see color. Yeah, it's all household mixed in in this household. So yeah, <laughs> <laughs> you saw my, And you know it's crazy. Like if, if like my uh my girl's mom, she was she wanted to tune in. She wanted to be on the podcast or something. And if everybody would have saw her, man, niggas would been like, <laughs> C Ray beats. I be white. Yeah, I know you white nigga. But uh, <laughs> well, you know what I'm saying. But anyways, you know, so, certain people are going to identify to with, with whatever they want. It's just not nothing I can do about that. And a lot of people have brought that up, like they, you know, they don't want to see black folks do hip hop anymore. Well, you know, and been seeing black folks do it or whatnot for the last couple of years. Uh, the cop that was like this comment right here. Uh, <laughs> so, shout out to people on Spotify that won't be able to see this, but. <laughs> Like, uh, they don't want to see black culture performed by us anymore. And obviously a lot of people did that. You know, I was just like, well, that's fine by me. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to sit there and just be upset about it. Um, you, you, you can either fear it or you can just go past it and just not even worry about it. Like, I mean, like when you start worried about it and let it get to you, that's when you start making it, 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 stuff start bad, start happening. Just focus on do what you got to do and just keep going. You'll be, you'll be fine. You ain't got to worry about nothing. Yeah. Yeah. Like, and on top of that, like, <laughs> like, like this one, um, one of the homies that he was talking about something. I was just like, man, I mean, it happens, you know, like people do feel like, you know, they, they're not going to identify with somebody because they are one thing and, and they do another. But that to me, I don't get like, I don't live, I don't live for, for, for people that do, do, uh, do that type of stuff. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but what I will uh, not tolerate is somebody that's going to just constantly take shit uh, that I've done and then just like regurgitate it to their to damn peoples and whatnot. And uh, 
And and not and on top of that, you can you can see when somebody's a, a a rat bastard like that. Anyways, like I saw, I remember a tweet uh, by KBZ. All he did was shout out like all the white creators. Like what? <laughs> all the motherfuckers are, are are up. Like 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 damn, you just don't fuck with niggas. <laughs> like you know what yeah, I'm saying? Like like because like, 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 I I, I kind of I I remember when Nick Mirror or he still does that and uh, tried to be slick about it, <laughs> slick hating on you and. You know, is just talking shit about you and all kinds of stuff. And the person that put you on was Tarantino of 808 Mafia. He's a black dude. So, yeah, what? <laughs> like, what? <laughs> Anyways, you know, it's, it's just funny how things well work out for people, you know. Um, so, you know, I, I, I kind of understand, like, where I'm at now. It's just like I don't even try to bother with even dealing with some of that stuff, because I'm in a better place than a lot of a lot of these folks, even though they are flexing on social media. Exactly, so, ain't no point. In flex, don't ain't no point. If I just do you, be be who you is. Like I said, I mean, it wouldn't be hard to flex, but ain't no reason. There's no reason to do it. I mean, it's not hard to flex, but yeah, niggas want. Why, why I, do it? Why do it? I mean, want to look I, important it, and have two hundred yeah. uh, thousand uh, uh, likes on their on their picture on fucking IG as if like. I can't do that. I I could I could yeah. easily do that because I mean your source has been been leaked. Like the people like, have reached out and and told me like, yo, this is how you promote all your stuff on social media. Like th- if you want like you to do like a Instagram live, IG live, we could do that and have people like comment on there and give you hundreds of hearts. And it's like that shit yeah. is fake as fuck. It's fake as fuck. And that's like yeah, somebody hit me like you know somebody got that got mad at me. It was like yeah, man, that's why you're broke like all like everybody. I'm like. Well, bro, I mean, oh, because I don't flash my PayPal account and my bank account, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm broke because I don't show that off. Why I gotta show you my money? That's my money, that's what I make. It's not nothing you do, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, flex is just it's just it's, it's a, it needs to stop, but is it going to? No, Mm-mm. you're going to know, but oh, you know, but it's what it is. So, I get I get most IGs is fake, yeah. Most IGs are yeah, fake. You, you bet your sweet ass is fake. I mean, Boy, holy shit, crazy. Like, I don't see some like man, some of the worst videos on IG. Like, like for real. Like, what is it about uh, the people that be on? I'm trying to say the n word less. You know what I'm saying? Because we sitting there talking about racism, and I'm over here promoting the n word. <laughs> my damn stuff. But I, I am so sick and damn tired of seeing uh, videos on IG of people doing <laughs> like <laughs> they're doing a drum, like they're doing a drum line. And shout out to South Africa, but they're doing the drum line and everything else is happening on there. Like that is not an entertaining video. Like how in the hell would, how do you think, why do you think people will actually believe that you are pop? Cause, cause the beat sounds good. I mean the whole, like that's so average. Like it's so average these days. Like for somebody to do a freaking video on IG and just do tap, boom, boom, tap. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. You, you know, pull up FL Studio, get the camera out, the, the cell phone, and start doing all this dance with the phone and doing flips and twists. <laughs> and that's I felt getting old too. Right, right. And I and I felt victim to that, and I probably won't stop that. But. I, I did. I did it when it, when it was when it was first popping. People were first doing it. First people were first, and I was like, I said, nah, I'm gonna stop doing that. And everybody still used. To, and I see a video of somebody doing, I'm like, bro, the beat don't even sound that good. You just the camera movement is dope though. I get it, the camera was going in, but the beat no. Yeah, cut out. But I mean, you know. So, yeah. I mean, it's weird flexing, man. It's, it's, it's just how it is. It's and, just- and see the thing, and it's crazy too that you would say that because, like, uh, one of I went and visited my homie at it, at his uh, new nightclub out here, and he was like, "Bro, I don't, I don't see you do cook up videos like that." I was like, "Well, you know, sometimes it's just like, what's the point of me even doing that?" And then secondly, like, uh, I just don't want to put all all my beats out there. Like, like I'm in, in the position, or not even in the position. Like, I have had my stuff bitten. And people will loop my shit. They they have t- asked me, well, if I if I take the sample, I'll give you credit, or I sample this video and get you cre- uh, and give you credit for. I'm like, but you but you but you're putting it on YouTube. You're not. You can't credit me that. Like if you if your video gets a million uh, views or whatever or or watch time, I'm not getting a dime of that. But you are though. <laughs> I mean, uh, if you're gonna do that kind of DM, say your video and get all the get all the uh, revenue, then since right. you want to do that, I mean, if I'm, if I'll say like, yeah, do that. You know, if I, if I, if I, if I, I guess I haven't made a lot of beats myself because I've been a lot of my beats I've been making for the artists I work with behind the scenes. So it's like, I mean, but I want to get back into beat making stuff. But it's like, yeah, you don't want to, like 
Y'all know back in the day when people used to rip my stuff and make make troll beats, which I don't mind that. You make a troll yeah, beat. Yeah, right, 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 right. You, hey, I love that. I love when people take my videos and make troll beats. We'll take my voice and make troll beats. That shit used to have me rolling. But people actually try to take your beats. And you make a beat, you cook it up, you, you play the whole song. And then next thing you know, you see a dude on YouTube produced by Mr. Different. Like, who the fuck is this dude? It's that same beat from my live stream. It's like, fuck. Yeah. Like, I don't know how I feel about that because I like people like somebody like uh, Kit Complete. Like Kit Complete just did a fire. He did a fire ass video, video talking about totally not fake collaboration. That's, that's his thing. Like that's his stick, and that, that really yeah. helps promote like my channel so, in, in a ways. And and on top of that, he actually has talent. So I I don't I don't mind people doing that. I don't I don't mind people doing that. I mean, just for my uh, M I O. Uh, damn M I O. I try to be be fly like the young guys and <laughs> I M O. You know, for my opinion or whatnot, I don't I don't have an issue with that. Yeah, it's, it's what it is, I said. But, you know, hey, we'll see how things go. Things could change this year. You know, it's still 2019, still early in the year. Some things could be happening. Y'all just need to stay tuned. Subscribe to both the channels. That's all to do. Subscribe to DJ, subscribe to me. It's going to be crazy. So uh, I guess that's all the topics. Man. Damn, going for a minute. Yeah. 69 minutes on this day. Oh, shit. 69 minutes in the day. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We, we, we are an hour and 10 minutes in. You know what I'm should saying? We do, should we do like a little Q&A then? Like we usually do? Yeah, yeah. We do a little short Q&A. So if you have any questions, guys, please feel free to leave them in the chat. And, of course, we'll read them out and try to answer them to the best full effect. I, I'm enjoying this this uh, Ashton origin. I'm in. It sounds good. It sounds good. It sounds good. Does yeah, it? It, just, it, it sounds good. Like I, I knew something was different when you first called me. I was like, I said, he must have got the ass in already. Mm -hmm. yeah, and as soon as you turned the, the screen, I was like, yep. And, the, yeah, yeah. and, and you're right, uh, too. So I, I, I do apologize. You don't. Well, I could kind of hear the P's, but it's not as bad as it would be on my other, on my, what was it, the AKG I got? Or yeah. The, or the freaking what's what what was that garbage I had the, <laughs> that that blue yeti? <laughs> Oof. Uh, C Ray P said, "Mr. Different and Busy Where Beats need to do a five to twenty minute uh, beat challenge for more." We, we need to. We actually it was crazy. Me and Busy Where Beats do got some content coming out soon. Word, so hey, we, we do. So yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah, we all we we all know me and Busy had beef back in the day, but we squashed that. We grown men. We said, you know, fuck that shit. We need to do it for the community. The community love both of us. Let's just do it for the community. So we, we squashed that, made 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 it right. Yeah, so we got content. Do I got some stuff I got to send to him? It should be coming soon on his channel. So be on the lookout for that. You know. So yeah, yes, got it, got it. You know that. You know, just trying to bring everybody to work together. All these content creators, too many good content creators on here. Yeah, we just need to stick together. That's all it is. Right, right. I, I will, I will love uh, for you know. Well, well, obviously all all the brothers we don't. <laughs> <laughs> we don't yeah. clean up our acts just for the fact, you know, because because I started seeing some shit and I didn't like it. I didn't like uh, again. It goes back to Curtis King, like just seeing his comment section and seeing the N word in there a lot, and then going to Nick Mears' uh, channel and he's making fun of freaking uh, uh, Curtis King. So when I look at shit like that, when I look at shit like that from people like him. And and then uh, the way they do shit yeah. over there, and I already know Taz Taylor ain't shit, but you know, like when I look at shit like that, I see it, and I'm like, man. So when, when they they just be laughing at us when we be bickering back and forth, so I was like, man, fuck this shit. You know, I want to uh get get right with MG the Future. You know, I I, right. I, I swallowed all my goddamn pride, and I was like, man, look, I'm oh I'm I'm 37. I just turned 37. Like, what the hell am I gonna sit here and just like be beefing with? with uh, uh other creators for what it's worth you know what i'm saying but you know but i looked at that and now i remember when we did the uh the first podcast trap Tendo podcast with me dj Payne one and me you and dj Payne one yeah, yep and the n-word was being dropped again when we was just talking about breaking news and not like we was shitting on uh nick mirror and i and i saw the n-word being dropped again so it's either him with a uh with a flip account or people that rock with him, I, I know I don't get. You can't be racist and then and then want to do hip hop like that. That shit don't yeah. make no sense at all. This is a diverse thing. Like, well, they, they black, don't want white, to. Man. They, they want to be edgy, <laughs> black, white, <emo> Asian, <laughs> Hispanic man. Like this, yeah. this, this is a melting pot here, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can't be racist here. <laughs> like, everybody does incredible stuff in this space. So right. so so having a having people in your your crew that's that's doing that racist shit that shit needs to stop, and the facts are there. You can go back to the you can look at my uh, Trap Tendo podcast uh, 
uh, playlist and go to the one with Nick Mayer and you read the chat and you will see the N word dropped re- like re- ridiculously and and even in the comment section as well. I didn't delete it at all. So yeah, I, I, I think that before you made me a mod anyway. I was gonna. I was like. I, you know, people need to see this so people can see like what people, how people really are, how they really feel about stuff. Which is like, come on, like racism. I mean, I, I don't. Like I guess I don't see color. Like I say my my baby mama's white, my kids are mixed. I don't see color. You know what I'm saying? I right. love everybody. You right. know what I'm saying? Her parents over, my parents over. They they come, they outside cooking all that. You know, it's it's all colors out there having a good time. I don't see color. Nope. You know, that's not, <laughs> Nick <don't>, Vulture. <laughs> Uh, yo, you got you got to have some respect for a lot of things, man, in the culture, man. And it's not and that, and being again being a culture vulture is not exclusive to someone being white. Because again, Eminem is definitely not a culture vulture by no yeah. means. And even even with yeah. the fact that he might be successful because he he's a white dude, regardless, if you look at skills for skills, he is nice, homie is right. nice. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like you can't you can't knock somebody like that. Now, Vanilla Ice. <laughs> next. Right. Next. 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 Just, just next. You know what I'm saying? Just, just, just next. You know? and, and I look at Lil Nas, too, because I'm looking at the Lil Nas X Cat. You know, uh, to me, that ain't country. That ain't country. I mean, yeah, it ain't country, <laughs> but I mean, it's, it's, I put like that. It ain't country, but it's catchy as fuck. Got to admit that. Right. She's catchy as fuck. It is mean, very I, I mean, it's, it's good. It's good to see he he did his thing, man. Well, I ain't mad at you no know saying he did his thing, but what's I good mean, about that is he Billy Ray Cyrus is is playing a good role in that as far as being in the remix. So that, you know right. that obviously puts it in into a perspective of now it could be a country song in consideration of having a country artist on there, and hopefully. Uh, Billy Ray will give him some knowledge about that shit because you know a lot of these youthful dudes they just want to jump into this sh- uh, jump into shit to say whatever it is and then th- they don't want to do the facts. But uh, Adam Twenty Two is not a vulture. No, he's not. No, like, Adam Twenty Two is definitely not a vulture. DJ Flat. Mm, I don't. I don't think he really contributes a, uh, for the good of the community. I think he does a lot of messy shit. Everybody needs. Everybody has to have a case pending for be an interview with him. Uh, yeah, right, right. But I don't think DJ yeah. Flat is a culture vulture per se. And then on top of that, I think he's what is he like Russian? So that kind of like puts him oh, in I, a in a decent perspective, I, probably. Of like, man, I don't like white people. I don't like black people. I don't like nobody. I like I don't like myself. <laughs> like, Damn. like my home, okay. like my homeboy from Russia. Well, he he's not like that, but he he's always mad. Like he's he, he, he his skin is always red, mad, uh, red as fuck. But. You know, he's like a helpful translator for me. He does a lot of stuff for me. Um, uh, Russian born Jew, word. <laughs> Whoa, that, damn. I'm trying to figure that one a question. I'm trying, I want to know for the community, what do you decide? <laughs> DJ Vlad is fans did. <laughs> hey, Let's see. You see white dudes uh, who call themselves the N word in jail. Oh no 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 no! no. All right, I got I got white homeboys, but they, but they qualify as a nigga because they are basically been living around niggas all their whole entire life. Now, do I I like it when they say that shit? No, but I know it's not like some some that. some Duke Jarek motherfucker uh, with a damn Confederate flag saying uh, saying nigga to me. And, you know you don't fuck with me at all. You know what I mean? Right. Yeah. So you know, we in the south too. So you know. It, we see it all. I see it all times. Like whatever. <laughs> boy, boy when, when, when niggas say boy to me, that 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 gets me more mad than than than, than the n word. The boy. boy, I ain't your damn dad, motherfucker. What? What? I I've been killing people with that. I don't know. Don't, don't call me that. Yeah, boy, you get over. Here. I ain't your damn boy. You ain't my dad. My dad beat your ass. <laughs> but yeah, um, I can't figure out what 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 you what I want to know for the community is when you decided to start music. What job did you do? And how did you separate your money? To, okay, so basically, like, mm-hmm. I guess, like, how do we, how do we come up in the music? Well, me. All right, go ahead. When I started, when I started on music, man. I, it was like, it was a, it happened like in middle school. I was like really good. Like, I've been, I was used, I was winning like story contests and poetry contests back in elementary and middle school. So I just wanted to elevate, and people were like, hey, you so good at that? Why don't you just put it to a beat? Cause I saw some guys rapping one day, freestyling in the in the, in the, in the uh, chorus room. In the choir, the chorus room, and you know, it's like I'm gonna start. I'm gonna try. It's just writing, you know, writing a poem to a beat. 
Mm-hmm. And then I, I got two. I kept doing. It. I learned. I, I took piano lessons. My mom made me take piano lessons. Never really cared about it, but I'm glad I took them because I know chords and how to play piano and all that. I don't really show my skills too much because it's just something I don't really care about like that. And then, like I said, one day I just, you know, started making beats. Uh, what was it PlayStation? Um, oh, man. Like, you you a yeah, generator loop, guy? Yeah, loop generator. And then it was like, shit, Acid Pro. So I don't Acid Pro. And then, you know, really I got serious about it when I, I made my first beat for my homeboy. He rapped on it. And then, you know, we rapped on it, made a song, passed the CD out in school. Everybody loved it. It was garbage. Tell you that right now, it was fucking trash. It was ass trash. It, it was worse than Soldier Boy stuff when it came out. It was trash. It's the well, same it, time Soldier Boy came it, out too. It, it, it shit, was, if it was worse than Soldier Boy, you might you had a hit. Shit. And then after that, man, just like I said, when I got my first job at McDonald's, I realized I want to do it. And started buying equipment, splitting it up, you know, taking care of a kid on top of that because I got my girl pregnant. And then just that's really what it was, man. Just started small and just you know taking every little thing i can and put it towards my passion but you know make sure i took care of what's important first and then you know put it towards that and then also just learning that's the that's the main thing i don't tell a lot of people i learn more than i make like i don't create as much as i learn i learn i read i read i search i research i practice more than i create and that's just something that's always been a part of me i love learning new techniques before i even create anything that's just me Personally, but they say it should be opposite, right? It sh- I should be creating more and learning less, but I, I just like learning. I just fuck it, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's just me. Yeah, I, I promise I was gonna. Oh, I saw somebody just like uh, play your old beat challenge. I, I saw that one, uh, Pain One, and all them was doing that. I, I I'm probably that. gonna do a video for that uh, if I can remember. Goddamn, I think but, I did. I did that one time. And it was, it was, it was fun. It was, it was funny. Yeah, them beats, but beats had me throwing up. I was like, no, nah, God, no, nah, I'm stop y'all. I can't do this no more. I listened to <laughs> some of my old beats, but I was like, damn, I actually could make some pretty dope loops with them. And some ass, but you know, whatever. You know, I was start, I was learning, but I guess I'm not even even go that long. Like my my thing is, I started making music when I like I've, I've been doing music since I was like probably nine, just uh, taking it serious, recording tapes and melodies and stuff like that. And I always like to try to find a way when it wasn't a way for me or I couldn't afford a drum machine to like, you know, record midis and song ideas. So uh, from there, you know, getting all this played instruments, of course, I played the violin and, you know, just stopped doing it because I wanted to play ball and get girls. But then at the same time, I didn't realize when I was playing in the, the orchestra, there was a lot of girls around me. So what, you know, but anyways, long story short, play started playing ball. Uh, started liking music again. A lot of the homies on the basketball team uh, could rap. I really couldn't rap that well, but they, you know, they they always would gas you up. Um, but fast forward from that, uh, two thousand going to, going to college. Uh, that's when a lot of the software and all that started popping up. Music generator, uh, the uh, acid uh, acid loops or live whatever the hell it's called acid uh, Sony cool, acid. Yeah. Yeah, so so it, that was there. That was pre Casa, so you could download software. So, but it was affordable uh, software, anyways. It was like twenty bucks, thirty, a hundred dollars. So yeah, you know, yeah. you just work a job and get it. Uh, well, but I, City. Yeah, um, but uh, uh, a friend of mine um, that was doing stuff with Nitty on the beat, uh, the Meet Me in the Trap is Going Down guy, and all that. They uh, gave me a MPC so I could make beats and shit on there. Uh, FL Studio came out. My homie came with the disc. Of course, it obviously wasn't fucking legit. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and slapped it on the hard drive, and we started fucking with that. The the MPC, the the music generator, asset loops, and all that shit. Um, but in between that, worked. Uh, I was cooking because I was still in school. I was cooking, uh, doing playing ball, and working at Red Lobster. So I had, that was dope. Uh, but I, I saved my money for to buy all my gear. Like I just saved all my money to buy my gear, and you know, just wanting the gear one shit. Fast forward to that. Uh, started getting uh, places, meet some people, meet my homeboys, get some uh, get some placements uh, on a couple of projects, uh, movies and stuff like that. Never somebody really big until like '09, and then I started seeing real money. Uh, but I was still working. Get fired. For, uh, for assault and battery. So that the shit out of my boss for talking shit. Uh, <laughs> no job, but I started my website, djabacree.net. And that's a uh, thing. It's ownership. You definitely want to invest in yourself. If I would have did that in 2006, 
instead of putting money into rockbattle.com, which I skipped oh, that. Oh man, I remember that. Uh, I would have I would have probably had more ownership, being able to kept my shit and had a, a bigger website than it is now. Uh, but anyway, slap shit out the boss was still was on YouTube, of course, uh, the whole entire time doing shitty quality videos like everybody else uh, before it became some fuck fest of, of everybody worrying about how professionally look instead of being a real human being, because um, that's what this YouTube is pretty soulless now. That's the way I feel. Uh, just start doing tutorials on YouTube and people just started liking them. Uh, 2015 to 2016 did 600 videos in one year damn but you're working bruh i was busy work big in the beats that bitch i was Hell doing yeah. it i was like that tell me i remember my first tutorial video that was fucking garbage in my opinion now because i was i was so monotone and so quiet <laughs> but i mean it, it's still one of my top viewed videos to this day still getting views it's that good i, I guess it's just people learned from it it's like damn so that's when I realized I had, I had the value of giving back to the community right. instead of, you know. Oh, 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 oh. My bad. I didn't mean to interrupt. I, I need to go back a little bit. In two, uh, 2010, I'm, I meet some fuckhead, some fuckboy uh, out in Vegas, and he's a piece of shit to this very day that fucks over, fucks over everybody in his community. But they, they believe him because he got this damn placement, and he's so great. And I sit there for X amount of years doing collaborations with him when I was already signed with Slip and Slide Records and, and doing stuff with them. Wasted all my goddamn time trying to do collaborations because he's feeding dreams and fucking niggas over. So 2015 comes and I start doing uh, music and stuff like that. And, you know, uh, yeah. <laughs> so yeah, we, so he eventually I, got his fucking credits as due, which he said he was going to put everybody on. And, and as you can see, every person that has fo uh, followed him that has had a, the brain power to understand that, that 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 he himself doesn't give a fuck about anybody. Uh, he just cares about himself and doing all the stuff. Of course, I was told that uh, drum loops and, and making presets was not going to get me nowhere or whatnot. And it's been... Uh, one of the few things, my, one of my many sources of income, I'm not making a lot, but hey, it's a source of income somehow, shape, or form that I'm decent uh, at doing. Decent, but you and Ocean View together, y'all fucking, y'all the, the, the twin best powers. Tag team <laughs> the best, y'all the best tag team I ever seen. Like if y'all, if if a, if a kit got y'all names on it, I'm getting that bitch. I don't oh, fuck oh, nobody. Appreciate that it. Shit. That shit's and, legit. And Ocean View was involved with that same fuck, fuck piece of shit bastard yeah. son of a Man, bitch. Man, I, I, I really want to leak the DMs, but I, I'm, I'm a better person. Uh, that save shit, them. Say, Man, it, you need to yeah, screen, it's, 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 screen I, I will, but, shot them some bitches for the future. Trust me. I'm telling you, I, I got, I got them saved and everything. It's like, because some shit happened too, and it's like, trust me. I'm going to show, I'm, I'm show how pussy this boy is, but not right now. I'm going to wait. This boy's super puss. Super. Oh, I hate that. I hate you, you, think, you think? You think? Oh, my bad. You think? <laughs> but anyways, yeah. like, like, uh, <laughs> like he, like, like, you know, we all have came from that same lineage. Of course, uh, I, I met Ocean View during a beat review or whatnot, and we, you know, understood that we, well, liked the same uh, things or whatnot. Uh, building proper community, that is. So, uh, and same thing with Imperial. Imperial, uh, super duper talented uh, sound designer, dope as hell, quality, that mo quality that, shit. That, that, that mode he be using. Yeah, he he, oh. he obviously know, knows a thing of two about sound design. Uh, shout out to Protocol Eleven. I, I I don't get to see him often. What's up, my brother? But uh, yeah, just just like fast forward from there and where we're at not right now. Uh, you know we're. 2019, we just pinning in the sea and what the hell is gonna go on, so so we can see the next move. But I don't think anybody should just sit down and wait on anybody uh, as as an opportunity to to actually gain some kind of notoriety in music. Like if you do that right. shit and you put your future in some other motherfuckers' hands, they're gonna always put themselves first because they know to put themselves first, and you will always be second. And then they're gonna try and take what you did the most work for and get all the credit for it just cuz so exactly just, just, just I was, know I, that. oh my bad i would say yeah just um go for it man don't don't let don't and don't put a dollar sign behind this shit here just do it because you want to do it right the money will come if you if you if you're really passionate about it and you got the drive for it and you feel like you can do something with it 
you're going to get what you're owed. Don't worry about the dollar sign. Don't worry about empty promises from these people because there'll going to be a bunch of them motherfuckers pop up talking about, hey, bro, I can get you on out of it. Fuck that shit. Do your own self. Become your own boss and just go for it, man. And, and shit, like, at the end of the day, we all have a millionaire built inside of us. It's just you have to figure out how to bring that millionaire outside of you. Yeah, That's and, all there and, is and, and, the, and, you, and the main problem right now is the U.S. government is trying to shut that down. Like, they know that people right. are, are can can make a can mess around overnight and make a million dollars. That wasn't common during the early uh the early 2000s and, and below like that's not that was uncommon for an average person like you know of course that you had the 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 software boom and and many right. other industries that boomed in that time period in the 2000s that was good but they went away now people are 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 what they're sitting down and playing video games and they're making millions of dollars like man, making stupid money that's man. that's no school no reason and school is meant and I, I don't want to be that guy that don't go to school because there are some benefits. Because I mean, I'm looking at people like Leslie Brasswaite, uh, John Fry, and and many other uh, studios out here in Atlanta. That hey, if you went to Full Sail, you're gonna you're gonna be an engineer there, and they're gonna want you in there versus some dude that just might. Oh, I know pro tools. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. but school in itself, uh, a lot of school. I mean, school was meant to be a trap a lot of schools overseas and stuff like that are free <clears throat> yeah not maybe not the best like cambridge and something like that or or the university of tokyo uh when you talk about perennial schools overseas um yeah. but it, it, it also depends on what industry you're joining into too because i don't want no i mean you don't you don't need to go to school to be a great producer engineer and all that you don't really it just you know it'd be a little bit more work, but still then. But if you're a fucking doctor, you better go to fucking school. You better operate on my brain, and you ain't go to school. Oh yeah, I just you know watched a video on YouTube on how to do open open brain surgery. Nah, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Nah. But, so, Get yeah, away from yes, me, motherfucker. Yeah. I'm on. I'd rather just die. <laughs> yeah, just, just, just pull the plug. So, pull the plug out. You know, say your last wishes. Pull the plug. Call the pastor and he'll preach for pray for me. Yeah, Boofu was like, man, stay away from student loan shit. We all got a man. We all got scammers. Oh, yeah. This generation right here, <clears throat> my like my son, our, our children's generation, they better they need to take advantage of what what is to come because, well, there's all this information that just wasn't out there when we was uh, starting. Uh, God, platforms remember, was great. What well, isn't nowhere near as great either. Oh, I remember you two first started, man. God, there was nothing cakes. out there. That had that HQ button. What well, shit? It was it went from three sixty p to the four twenty p. Yeah, no, they should have no information out there, and it was it was everything was bad quality. It was it was horrible. So now you can FL just, was trying. Uh, Image Line was trying at least with, with their FL tutorials. Yeah. They just what was they, like they too war beats and all video that too, tapish. Man. Yeah, they had war beats. I mean, he did a bunch of videos and all that good stuff back in the day, though. So yeah, but now now you can just type online how to do something. It's like a million videos, articles, blog posts, books. People I mean, copying other people's damn tutorials, yeah, motherfuckers. <laughs> but yeah, so I mean, yeah, take advantage of what you the knowledge that's out there today. Get as much as you can and use that to better yourself. Because at the end of the day, like I said, everybody in here is a millionaire. You just got to become one. You just got to just bring them out. So I guess we better head out. Cause I know my girl and that woman to get the kids. Right, right. We an hour and thirty two minutes in, bro. I'm hungry. I'm hungry as fuck too. So it was, <laughs> it was, it was a good stream. This is, this is the best stream so far. Right, I said right, it every right. time, but this was the best one of all time so far. Yeah, we, we greatly appreciate everybody for tuning in. Where 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 were we at? Uh, uh, we we were uh we're at eighty two. Like that might be the biggest I've ever seen us uh as far as like viewers. But I guess it's Easter Sunday and everybody needs something to do. <laughs> yeah, yeah, man. After you eat, what's what's to do? Just sit around? I guess you ain't no can't go nowhere. Yeah, <laughs> so, it's like all these dudes talking shit. <laughs> these these y'all. Let's go watch these two. But yeah, shout out to the chat. Appreciate you guys. Don't forget to thumb this video up. Give DJ Ava a like. Also, subscribe to his channel, bro. Hit that bell so you know <laughs> we go live all the time. Because come on. Y'all don't want to miss this. Y'all want to miss this. Oh, Great, greatly appreciate it, guys. I'm glad everybody joined out. You already know what time it is. Uh, and shout out to the Source team. <laughs> there we go. Appreciate and, uh, it. We are going to hit y'all with that thing.